face the Midnight Raven, and today we're going to do the world's biggest advent calendar. Yes. I'm not kidding. Look at this. Look at that bad boy. This is the Man Stuff by Technic. This is the Man Size Advent Calendar. This contains 24 items. Um, I got this off eBay. And I got it for eighteen ninety nine. I have seen it floating around for various prices. I've seen it as low as um eighteen, which is what I bought it for, and I've seen it as high as twenty five pounds. So you need to look on eBay and get your prices and, and check everywhere. Um like I said, I got it for eighteen. I believe the value is meant to be um twenty three. Some people are underselling it, some people are overselling it. It is a massive calendar. I did the man I did the man stuff calendar last year. If you remember it was a small cube one if you watched my channel, which is a very small 12 item cube. This year they've gone the full hog and they've done the 24 days. It is absolutely huge. We're gonna take a look and see what we can get. Obviously, I paid $18.99. Some people are charging 23, some are charging 25. Is it worth $18.99 for 24 items? I would assume so. That would make every item in here at least worth a pound. Um, and looking at just the front gives me hope that it's going to be totally worth the 18 pounds. Um, 18.99, sorry. So I'll leave a list down below of everything that was in this thing and where I got it from. And then if you want to try and get it. Obviously, I'm filming this in October because I wanted to get this um, and beat the rush. This will come out in December's video, so if you're watching it right now, I bet I'm guessing it's December. Um, so I don't know if you can still get this, whether it's still available, but I wanted to showcase this because it's going to be my partner's present. So we're going to take a look and see what we got. So day one. Obviously, my partner isn't going to have it in the calendar, unfortunately, but that's got to make a YouTube video. So, day one, <laughs> he's not really into advent calendars anyway, so this will all go in his stocking. So. Mm. so, day one is the Man Stuff Post Shade. So, my partner's always getting the, what we call the red face afterwards. Love the colour and the detail and then it's all kind of looks like it's in the forest. So, that's kind of cool. That's number one. Okay, I'm going to have to put it down because the calendar is just too heavy. Day two, I'm going to need both my hands for this man size calendar, I would think. Okay, day two, it looks like we have some soap. Okay, day two is some soap. It smells really nice. I love the packaging though. It's all nice and packaged. Um, and obviously they're following the forest theme on that. That's day two. Okay. Day three. This man size calendar makes it really hard to find the numbers. Day three. Ooh. We have some freezers. Judging by it. Yeah, tweezers. Man's got to have tweezers. They're always doing woodwork, and my partner's ever getting splinters from being out in the garden and doing wood. So there's some tweezers. Okay, day number four is another big one. Day number four, we have a travel toothbrush. So my partner goes away quite often for reenactments for his and stuff so we have a travel toothbrush I love it how you um you fit that in there and then you use it as the handle so that's pretty cool um it does fit in there it does take a bit of doing but it does and it has it like that so that's pretty cool so it's got a handle as well and then it stores okay today number five I'm loving these advent calendars you know, I used to hate Christmas, but then they brought that advent calendar out and they made it makeup and they made it baths. And, and now, I'm, now, I'm into, now I'm into Christmas. Okay, day five is a man stuff charcoal face wash. So charcoal has been a big thing 
for about the last year or two. Um, so we've got a face wash. My partner uses face wash quite a lot. Day number six, Ooh. we have um, one of these sponge things. So they're like uh, the little pom poms you get. So I won't take it out of the package because it's everything. But it's one of these round sponges that you get. So that's pretty cool. I like how they've packaged it as well. Okay, so it's day number six. Day number seven. What day? Yeah, day number seven. They're losing track now. Losing track already. Day number seven. I can't see where the border is. Professionally unboxed, as you can see. Okay. Day number seven is stuck. Okay. Day seven is emery board. So you've got this pack here of little emery boards. How cool is that? And look, they've even got wood detailing on them. How cute is that? That is so cute. I love that. Okay, so that, that's really excited me. Okay, day number eight is another big window. Love big windows. Day eight, we have some hand and nail cream. So my partner does a lot of outdoor work, so his hands are always complaining that they're dry. So this will come in handy. So day number eight, is the hand and nail cream. Like I said, my partner's hands get really dry, so um, that will come in handy. Day number nine. Day number nine, we have a bath fizzer. My partner's not a big thing for bath fizzers or bath bombs or something like that. But again, um, it's important to bathe and bathing and being outside. Um, and away quite a lot, having something small like that would come in handy. Ooh, day number 10. Ooh, day 10. Ooh, look at this. Wow, it's a brush and a comb. That's pretty cool. I can get it to undo. Ooh, it's just a little bit stiff. But we've got a brush one side and a comb the other side. So that's pretty cool. So that's another travel item that he'll be able to use. I love how the men's stuff um, are travel um, items. That's pretty cool. Okay, day number 11. Where's day number 11? Oh, it's over here. Okay. Day number 11. Oh, we have some hand sanitizer. So obviously working outdoors, you have to make sure that you clean your hands. So we have some hand sanitizer. I'm sure it smells gorgeous. It doesn't smell very much, but then again, hand sanitizer doesn't tend to. Um, but it's still good. It's um, gel antibacterial, so that's kind of cool. Okay, number 12. I'm going to... 12. If I can find number 12. Number 12. Come on down. Here it is. It is a very big box to try and to try and undo. Okay, day number 12. Ooh. I've got what looks, I want to say it's a pumice stone. It looks like this. I believe this is a pumice stone. We will check at the end. Um, my partner again gets dry feet so that will definitely definitely um come in handy so day number 13 we have some nail clippers once again working outside dirt and stuff comes in handy nail clippers day number 14 so I'm loving these items so far. Day number 14. Oh, we have some hair and body wash. Again, 
loving the sizes, all good sizes, and again, all the detailing on it looking like the outdoors. Day number 15. is here. Oh, and we have a bath fizzer. If I can get it out, that'd be good. Thing with bath fizzers are is they're really fragile. And I don't want to break it. Hang on a minute. Well, that took some getting out. So it's a bath fizzer and it's in the shape of a star. So this is day 15. So, so far it's looking pretty cool. We've got bath fizzers, we've got soaps, we've got body washes, we've got loads of cool items. And there's still more. So day 16. I do love 24 days of Christmas now. Hopefully my partner will love this as much as me. Okay. Oh, now we have some body lotion for day 16. Again, lovely travel size. I love how they're all the same sizes. It's really cool. Okay, day 17. Day number 17 is here. If I can get it open. Calendars always annoy me. Okay, day 17. Oh, doesn't have anything in. It's empty. But it is over here. It has fallen out once again. Items have fallen out. So it is a comb. Day 17, we have a nice comb. Um, we do already have a travel comb and brush. So maybe didn't need this one. Should have just kept with the comb, I would have said. Um, but nevertheless, okay, so what are we on? Day 18. Day 18 is another soap. So we've only had one soap so far, so um, it's perfectly acceptable to have two soaps in one. Um, they are small bars, obviously. So day 18 was a soap. Day 19. Well, it's another big one again and this time it's foot lotion so we've done hands we've done face we've done body and now we're looking after your feet hard working feet yeah. foot lotion okay day 20 day 20 okay day 20 again doesn't want to come out <laughs> Even if they're perforated, it doesn't mean anything. Day 20. Ooh. We have a nail brush. So these are pretty cool. I love. The idea is you stick your hand around like that and then obviously do your nails. Pretty cool. I don't know if I get my partner's fingers in there. He has quite big hands. Um, that's day 20. Okay, day 21. We're getting down to the last bits now. Um, we've got hair gel. Hair gel always comes in handy. My partner doesn't really use hair gel. He uses brill cream. He's, he's not um, he's like stuck in the 1940s, but hair gel. Day 21. Day 22. So we're down to the, the last few now. Of this, I would say, possibly the best calendar I've ever opened. Um, we have some nail scissors. These come in handy as well. Uh, Kono clippings and that my partner doesn't use these use nail clippers. Got a nice pair of scissors. Twenty-three. Oh, day twenty-three is bath salts again, but this time oh, no, we bath, no, we haven't had bath salts. So here we have a bath salt. It was my other calendar that had like loads in. So I got bath salts. And in case they rip, they've actually put it in this plastic thing, which is kind of cool. Because I actually opened a calendar last year. It was a Disney calendar for Beauty and the Beast. And the packet inside, um, when I opened the door, actually tore and it went everywhere. There's a video of me looking less than impressed. 
but this is in a little box love the idea of this more people should do this obviously it costs more but um okay and the last day 24 last day pray for something Ooh, oh we've got some shaving cream got to shave christmas eve got to shave christmas eve to look all nice for christmas day so there we have some shaving cream so this was the calendar it looks pretty good now I my calendar. <laughs> so all in all the calendar i paid for was 18.99 like i said the calendar has varied online i've sent it for 18 i've sent it for 24 i've sent it for more so it's not selling for a particular price on ebay um i haven't seen it anywhere else apart from ebay um but i will show you what we got so we've got hand sanitizer we've got a pumice stone nail clippers hair and body wash we have the bath fizzer the post j balm the soap the tweezers the travel toothbrush we have the charcoal face wash we have the sponge we have the gorgeous emery balls i love the fact that they've got the logs on there the hand and nail cream we have the bath fizzer and the hairbrush and comb. Um, we have the body lotion. We have the black comb. I still believe they didn't need this and that they could have put another item in. This is kind of a throwaway item. And um, they could have put another bath fizzer in there or something instead. Uh, soap, the foot lotion, the nail brush, hair gel and scissors, the bath salts, shaving cream so everything literally everything in this thing is just awesome apart from this because i already have a comb so i believe that's a throwaway item um that wasn't really needed um but that's just me um the fact they already had a comb it seemed like an irrelevant item but i mean but this was everything, literally everything. So many items, look at that. I mean, for £19, you've definitely got your money's worth there, more than your money's worth. Um, would I have paid 25 I mean, for what you've got, I don't think so. I think the calendar itself... Um, I don't know how much it is on the actual Techniques website. I will see if I can find this on the actual Techniques website and find out exactly how much it's selling for. But like I said, I bought it for $18.99 off eBay. I will write at the top if um, the site was doing it for differently. But it's definitely worth £19, I would say. It's 24 doors. They are pretty full-size items there. Only 30 mils, but they are full size, and the bath bombs are big ones. So I would say pretty good. I suppose the only thing you're really missing is a deodorant. So maybe if they'd have took this out, they could have put a deodorant in, but then they'd have to charge you a bit more. So you've got literally everything apart from deodorant to go away with, or they could have took this out and put a flannel in, because you've got a sponge, they could have put a little teeny flannel in. So, yeah, maybe a deodorant or a flannel is, like, the only thing they're missing. Um, apart from that, I think the calendar did fine. So, if you want to see all my other calendar unboxings, there is a playlist that will pop up at the end. If you want to, like, subscribe to me, give me a big thumbs up. Please do so. I love the fact that they're doing man calendars, as they call them. I do love man stuff. I will be buying a lot more from man stuff. For Christmas by Techniques. I bought some last year. I'm definitely buying some this year. If I buy any more, I will quite happily uh, bring you a video because I think their stuff is amazing and well priced. So if you haven't already, big thumbs up, like, subscribe, and I'll see you very soon for another advent calendar unboxing. Take care and thanks for watching. Bye.